Hey everybody, it's time for another update on the Miata project. So I'm gonna to try to keep this one short. Uh, I noticed you guys have only been watching for about two minutes on average on my videos, so I'll see how much I can pack in quickly. And make sure you stay tuned till the end because I'm gonna insert an exhaust clip so you guys can check out how our custom exhaust sounds. So from that statement, you can tell that the car is running and the idea was to get it driving for the first autocross event at the end of April but unfortunately that didn't happen. And it wasn't because we couldn't get the car ready in time. It was mainly because of the weather. Uh, we saw on Thursday that it was gonna be rain all weekend. So we just kind of slowed down a little bit. We didn't kill ourselves trying to get it done. And things have been getting pushed back since we weren't gonna drive the car that hasn't been painted in the rain. And it just wouldn't have been a good time. Also with the state of the wiring is in, I can show you guys that that wouldn't have been great. And I mentioned in the last video that I was gonna reveal the name of this once the car is actually driving, but it's running right now. I wouldn't say it's driving, so that'll probably have to wait till the next video. But something I need to update you guys on is the seating situation. One of my dad's friends at work actually donated two pretty awesome seats to us. Got these nice Corbo racing seats. It's a matching one for the opposite side upstairs, but it's gonna be a lot better than these crappy stock seats but I'll go ahead and show you guys what the car looks like now quite a major change from a month ago we went from just a chassis to a car with all the components that you need for driving finished up the welding did some grinding to polish those out but yeah they're not perfect I mean we're on a budget we're not trying to make this thing look perfect it's a race car not a not a show car. We got the wiring installed. There's ECU. It's wired up enough to run, so I mean that's what matters. Got the fuel system all plumbed up. That's working. We got the exhaust welded up and installed. And also these aluminum floors. So that's pretty awesome. The next things to do are gonna be getting those seats figured out, uh, cleaning up the wiring, trimming, and getting that tucked away. Um, and then once it's driving, test for reliability, see where the weak points are, make sure it's gonna drive, drive well now that the concept is proven. Then it'll be doing a teardown, clean up, prime and paint the chassis, reassemble, then figure out how we're gonna make this thing better. Probably start off with some wheels and tires, then just go from there, tuning, suspension. The car is basically to the point where the concept has been proven and it's almost ready to drive. So that's really awesome. But what you guys are sticking around for is the exhaust audio. So I'll go ahead and set up for that and meet you guys back for then.